Hi, my name is Justin Conway. I get a lot of questions about how to organize data in Microsoft Excel. There are so many different features in Excel, so many formatting options. Um, I'm going to cover a few different ways to organize, pretty simple ways, uh, but good to know and um, easy to perform. So um, the first one that I'll cover is uh, looking at the Excel sheet that I have set up here, I have various pieces of data in different groups. Um, in different areas spread out or, along the sheet. If I want to bring this information together, make it a little more presentable, or make it so that it all fits on one sheet, what I'll do is um, select an area that you want to move. Uh, best way to do this is cut and paste the information to the new area. So select everything. Command X will cut, or right click and select cut, and then select a new cell where you want that information to go, and Command V or right click and select paste, and that information will, uh, will move over to that area. Um, and you can perform that with, with any other uh, piece of information that you have in your Excel sheet. Um, another thing that I'd like to cover is, so in this area, I have products in column A and uh, company names in column B, but I don't have a title at the top and there's no room for a title. So easy way to fix that problem is to select the entire row, right click, select insert, and now you have a new row. We can add a title in here, we'll call this product, and uh, tab over to the other area, we'll call this company. And now we have our titles in there. And then to make this uh, more appealing and, and more, uh, you know, uh, just make it stand out as a title. Uh, what I would always like to do is bold it. So you can either hit Command B or select this little B button here or this one here. They're all the same function. Uh, and now it looks like actual titles. A last step would be to select the areas here, right click and go to Format Cells and you can add a border. By clicking there, you have uh, an underline going across. And then one more thing that I'll cover is sorting. Um, let's say we wanted the numbers in this area to be represented lowest to highest. So we're going to select the first row and hold down shift, select the last row, go to data, sort, select the row that, uh, the column that we'd like to sort on, which is column B, select OK. And as you can see, all the numbers have been um, reorganized from lowest to highest. So those are various different ways to organize in Microsoft Excel. I hope it helps. My name is Justin Conway. Thanks and enjoy.